What effect is a multi-year drought having on the Colorado River Basin? That's the question more than 2,500 high school students tackled as they competed for $100,000 in scholarship prizes in the Moody's Mega Math Challenge. To stop this potential crisis, what we need to do is increase inflow to Lake Powell and decrease outflow from Lake Powell. It's not just about being quick with computational ability. You need to be able to apply the skills to the real world. In the first round of the challenge, teams downloaded the problem from the contest website. They then had just 14 hours to create and upload a detailed solution paper. Working for the 14 hours, I mean, it was a very long day, but it was definitely a great learning experience, learning about how to work with everyone. It's just really interesting. After the submissions are received, panels of professional mathematicians spend several weeks evaluating hundreds of entries, eventually selecting just six of the teams to present their papers at the competition finals in New York. Which is a total of 82.3 million acre feet of water over 10 years. Well, I think that it's it's wonderful that students get exposed to the complexity of problems and how mathematical analysis can lead to interesting conclusions. You get to see high school students that are able to produce these models that you know hopefully will eventually be implemented in solving these real life issues in the world. Yeah.